The capture of immature fish across the country's water bodies is still impacting on the growth of Uganda's own output for local as well as export earnings, which remain at less than $150 million. For you to realize sustained, increased and rapid growth, will require that you increase production and productivity in the dominant sectors. A renewed effort at aquaculture production, which stands at approximately 100,000 metric tons today, has since seen Uganda's own target of production, placed at 300,000 metric tons over the mid-term. We have to encourage aquaculture as a, a sustainable means of uh, ensuring that we have uh, fish for, for trade, for foreign exchange and uh, for food security. A regional meeting collecting together Uganda, Kenya and Tanzania under the Indian Ocean Commission and the European Union is seeking to raise the bar on compliance of fish resources. So many people are taking fish across the border through using the motorcycles, fish which is not inspected, fish we, we, they don't pay any taxes. So in this process of harmonized procedures, we want to see that what is done in Uganda should be done in Kenya to be Tanzania, so that we sustain the source. Reina Ojun, NTV Business.